Tim, help me. Go to bed. I already did, bro. Go back. No, fuck you. How'd you help me brew, Tim? What? When did you help me? Oh, did you mean sleep? Yeah. Tim sleeps all day. Old pal told me to restart my brain, so I did. Beep boop. Beep boop boop. Beep beep boop boop. Ryan, just do this deck in blue. So you can play Flying Men and Delver. Oh yeah, so uh, Arena just glitched on me last game. And uh, I cast an enchantment that I'm supposed to draw a card. Um, and he's supposed to discard a card. What enchantment? Uh, I forgot the name of it. But like, I had already played it, so I already know how it works. Anytime I surveil, it returns to my hand. But, uh... So I'm not saying you're wrong. Arena is Arena's buggy. But statistically, if I was a betting man, I, I would say it's probably more likely that you're wrong about something. There, there were no buttons that I could click at all. Was there a Planeswalker in play or something? No. You sure there wasn't, like, a static effect that prevented it from happening or something like that? No. You sure not just stupid? Yeah, I'll show Ryan the. I should have taken a screenshot. Um, is there like a? Is there it, it just went through a, both my timers and then it ended my turn and returned it to my hand. There's no um, intervening if. There, there was like a. It started the opponent's turn timer, like where it was like, oh yeah, he's about to run out of time, and then it, it drained mine instead. Like his like popped up and then his never went down. So wait, wait. Explain exactly what happens, just in game terms. I cast enchantment. That's, uh, let's see, what does it say? What's it called? I don't know, I'm in a game. Uh, okay, just wait till it's over there. Angelic wall. Boom. I'm just saying, you you may have missed something. It's a it's a black, blue... Yeah, that's fine, it just... Like, yeah. I, I surveil, or no, I, I draw a card, he discards a card, and if I surveil, it returns to my hand. Oh, that, the replay unlimited or something? I, I don't remember the name at all. No, it's Add not. one of Angel's Grace and put in four angelic walls. Angelic wall? Um, Fuck yeah. Just a zero four flyer, one and a white. <laughs> nice. What a card. Really? Mm -hmm. Break me again. One of Angel's Mercy. Boom. <clears throat> oh man, what a card. You should play Hallowed Light. Oh yeah, that's a real... Dude, actually, that's like one of my favorite cards in Popper. <laughs> the card is... Is it, real. A is it a common? Wait a minute, oh, it's not the card I'm thinking of. Is it... Hallowed Light? Yeah. Oh, yeah. oh, I can instant replay. Oh, no, a mythic card from uh, Innistrad. <laughs> that, like, you remove cards from your graveyard and gain seven life for each one. What? I don't, just look up like mythics from Innistrad. It's white. It's just bad. <laughs> I believe you. I don't. I don't need to see. It. You have the name wrong though. Um. I don't know what to do for the mana base. This is gonna be an expensive ass mana base because every I want every single thing to be white for a spectral procession, but I also need a good amount of black. Oof. Maybe I shouldn't run Thoughtseize. This is going to get so hard to cast Thoughtseize turn one without making massive concessions. <clears throat> Emiria Angel. Now I should run Iona, right? Yeah. Just, yeah, run one of each White Angel. 
Isn't she banned? No, she got banned in Commander. That's right. <laughs> <laughs> banned in Modern. <laughs> Just kidding. No, as it turns out, if you want to cast... Um... Okay, I can't remember the name of the card. But the... The four drop sorcery that reanimates something from your graveyard. If you want to cast that on Iona, more power to you. It's a reasonable play in modern, depending on what you're against. Alright, I want you to play this card Mark of the Oni. Um, I don't even know how to spell that. I didn't spell that. Mark of the... Oh, oh I found it. Kamigawa. If you troll no demons, sacrifice. Is it just troll me time? <laughs> <laughs> There's been, like, just enough reasonable suggestions so that I'm still looking them up. <laughs> 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 we're quickly... You just gotta do like a bait and switch. <laughs> the ratio is quickly going downhill. Okay, so no thoughts use. A luminous okay. angel. A luminous angel? I don't remember that actually. Oh, perfect. I can, <laughs> I can make flyers. <laughs> oh, yeah, Platinum Angel. I bet you don't know that card. <laughs> Big fan of Platinum Angel. <laughs> hey, play Angel of Invention. Don't think that that's sounds enough. good. Yeah, it's a four drop, right? Yeah. I don't think it's good enough. Oh, that's... Oh, fuck. No, it's a five drop. Yeah, it's oh. not good enough. I thought it was four. It actually has a great effect, though. It just I know. says other creatures get plus one, plus one. That's why I suggested it, but I thought it was a four drop. It's actually a great card, but no, it's too much. Segovian Angel. Two of... <laughs> oh, yeah, you can play Segovian Angel. Sig go. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to find that one. S E G O V N <laughs> V I A N. It's a 1 1 for 1 flying vigilance. Nice. There might be a viable angel though, I don't know. That, that one. Possible. Actually, yeah, Archangel of Thune is pretty damn strong. Yeah, that play, card is... play, play Resplendent Angel. It's also not that bad. I don't, I don't think it makes the cut there. Please. Just make just make an Angel deck. <laughs> I'll be the first person who ever made one. No, I've thought about it before. It... You could probably build it a successful angel deck in modern. You just want to look, look up the card of. I think it's called. I've thought about it for a while now. I'm pretty sure you can make a deck that just slams Lyra, Dude. Dawnbringers, and Bane Play Bishop of Wings. Is this the standard card? That's not good. Uh, and an angel deck. <laughs> Why wouldn't you play one in treat? Serious question. <laughs> what does it cost if you hard cast it? It's like... A lot. <laughs> oh, you need five mana to get one angel if you hard cast? <laughs> yeah, but you just, you just play one. <laughs> Oh, just, why don't you just play an angel back? 
You could actually build one. I don't know how good it would be, but like I said, I'm pretty sure Bane Slayer Angel and Lyra Dawnbringer just beat a lot of decks in Modern right now. Hold on. Bishop of Wings is pretty good with Segovian Angel. Yeah. Duh. Okay, yeah. Hodges, play Bishop of Wings, Segovian Angel, and then look up Divine Visitation. <laughs> do I even want to look this up? No, no, you do. This is a real deck. Time to make a new deck. <laughs> That's pretty fucked. And then there's a lot of other stuff that plays off a of life total. So blue white angels right here. Let's go. And also, why do you guys keep trying to add blue to shit that has nothing to do with <laughs> How does one I'm done with this deck idea unless we're playing Angel Tribal in modern. <laughs> I mean, if it was if it was competitive, it wouldn't be tribal. Probably it'd just be like an angel deck. All right, what about a red white angel deck? Would you be okay with that? Yeah, it's probably the real way to run it, but it's not gonna look like what you guys wanted to. It's gonna be like it's gonna be the most Timmy deck. It's basically gonna be prison. You'd probably run Chaos of the Void and Blood Moon. Uh, no. <laughs> and wow. Probably run Fucking Glory. try hard here. There's probably another way to build it. You like saying words, but I just don't understand why they're coming out of your mouth when there's just not, they're not yet. Yeah. <laughs> if I ever see a blood moon, I'm gonna fucking reach across the table, take it out of its sleeve, and rip it in half. <laughs> <laughs> Honestly, Blood Moon's even not even that good right now. <sighs> it can still get people, though. It's good enough. Sometimes. Alright, so let's not forget the list that we started making. Yeah, actually... Why don't you and I just make an angel deck, pal? Forget Ryan. And, yeah, and we're gonna also make it with Changeling. Is there a good Changeling? <laughs> What's that blue-white one that just came out that's pretty good? The one that's all playing Slivers? You know what I'm talking about, Ryan? Or Vampire or something? Yeah, it's it taxes removal. It's okay. It's a two-drop. Two-drop two-two, I think. Changeling. So Segovian Angel, is there any two drop angels? Or, oh, the Bishop of Wings, that's who we Yeah, play. Woodland Changeling. That no. is a two drop angel. Bishop of Wings. Three drops, we have Resplendent Angels. There's a really good two drop angel. It's uh it's two white and it it's uh three three. Vigilance Vigilance Life Length? Or maybe just Vigilance. Oh, wait, you have to play Sarah Angel. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Oh, wait a minute. Or is that the... Is that like the six drop? Sarah Angel? Yeah. You really don't know what Sarah Angel is? I'm getting... I, the angel that's been printed in every single fucking core set since the beginning of time. Like the most iconic white magic card ever printed? Five like, mana, four, four, flying vigilance? Yeah, the card I'm thinking of is very close to that. It's, it has a similar name. It's like, uh... Sarah something, I think. All right, maybe uh, Angelic Renewal with Bishop of Wings. Then if one of the angels dies, it just gets reanimated instantly. So you now get the token and See, the now, angel. Now we're brewing. Mm-hmm. Hey, pal. When did you play Magic and for how long? Uh, back in 2003 for two weeks. Mm-hmm. <laughs> He's played a lot more than that. Not even lying.
I played standard off and on for years. Hodges, is Angel of Jubilation just not playable? Since like 2010. What's it do? Four mana, three, three flyer. Creatures get plus one, plus one. Uh, players can't pay life for sack creatures to cast spells or activate abilities. I don't know why, but unless I read the card, my brain doesn't okay. process it. Do you know uh, how high my IQ is? This is fairly playable. Eh, it's probably not good in modern though. If you want a four drop angel that's generically good, you should run the uh, the tax angel. It sounds pretty strong. What creature are changelings more than any other? Angel. What, what creature exactly? Do you know why? Who is this? Who is No, because angel is literally in the name. No, Angle is in the name. You fucking idiot. <laughs> Sorry, Angling is in the name. Oh yeah, Angelic Page. Two mana, one one flying. You Tap have to it. call it Changeling. <laughs> I play Woodland Changeling in attack mode. <laughs> okay, how about Angelic Rocket? That sounds weird. Is that a goblin card? Fucking look that up. I don't want to do <laughs> What the fuck is that? Sounds perverse. Uh, mm -hmm. Angel of Vitality. 2-2 two, two for 3. If you would gain life, you gain that much plus 1. And then it gets plus 2, plus 2 if you have 25 or more life. That was very recently printed. Oh, the card I was thinking of, Hodges, is Archangel's Light. It's 8 mana so, sword. You gain if two you life have... in the graveyard. There are actually some very strong angels. Just have how, do, how does the ETB effect work with this? If you have Bishop of Wings and then you play Angel of Vitality, they see each other, right? So you effectively gain five life, you instantly have a 4-4. Four, four. Assuming you were on 20. They both go on the stack at the same time. And then you just order them however you want. So okay. it's, not, it's not a case where they need to like see each other or anything. They just both trigger. So, but yeah, they definitely see each other as long as your opponent doesn't interfere or anything. There's um, avian changeling. Is a Myria angel just not good enough for your deck? A Myria? I don't think so. I remember that's a generically okay angel, but wait, what does it even do? It's a it's a three four for four with some effect. No, it's a three three. Ooh, dies the bolt. No, this is not good enough. Okay, what about Gabriel Angel Fire? Not good enough. You don't even know what it does. I already know it's gonna be some expensive ass Boros card. It's not. You're wrong. <laughs> really? Yeah. Oh, god, god damn it. <laughs> Why don't you no, trust me? I have to look it up. <laughs> oh, fuck is this? You know you're a real OG. <laughs> <when> <laughs> Go to your local game store with cards in your modern deck that are clearly not <laughs> modern legal. But they're, but they're so legit that they don't say anything. <laughs> Dude, I wonder if anyone would, if you were like pretty charismatic and respected in the community, if you went with like just some jank ass like <laughs> cards. It, if seriously, they'd let you go all night. Like no one do would, a tournament. Yeah, <laughs> if no one would <was>, like. <laughs> I'm playing in my next uh, in my next game of standard. <laughs> I'm gonna go to the store and I'm just gonna play like cards that come in like the uh, starter deck. So I'm gonna play like Shiv and Dragon. Um, I'm gonna play Nightmare. There's you know, some hella jank that you could play. 
Did you know that Shivan Dragon is just always standard people? That's, is that actually true? Yes. <laughs> uh, 